Euripides Media has always been uh, one of my favorite plays, um, and I, I started working on it thinking about how maybe I could do a tribute and a parody, how could I uh, approach the themes from a comedy perspective. And along the way, I rediscovered or found new layers on this incredible play. There is a very good reason why, after 2,500 uh, years, this continues to be the most popular classic, Greek classic uh, perform around the world. And, um, and I discovered, you know, the play talks about many things. It talks about the dangers of xenophobia. It talks about revenge and violence. It talks about sexism. Uh, it talks about manipulation. Um, and all those things I thought were so uh, current and so up to date. I'm thrilled uh, that for this production we were able to bring uh, Lisa Holson from Washington DC. Lisa actually was the starring uh, actress in the previous production, the third production of this show in Washington DC. And uh, now she comes to Chicago for a reinvented version that I adapted for her, for the city of Chicago, and for a stage at 773. Well, Medea is so reviled because of the act that she did, um, the revenge that um, she enacted by killing her own children. And then at the end of the play, she gets away with it. Um, she leaves the stage triumphant um, and, and doesn't receive any punishment, uh, which was a huge scandal in Euripides' time. Um, how I identify with her struggle and, and um, uh, her journey. Well, I mean, who who hasn't had a broken heart? Um, now I haven't killed it, my children or anything like that. But I mean, I can I can appreciate um, pain, loss, betrayal, the desire for revenge. The one woman show is approximately one hour long, but it's a huge challenge for an actress. Uh, Lisa gets to play eight different roles. She plays comedy, she plays tragedy, she plays melodrama. Um, so it's, it's a wonderful challenge and a great vehicle, and I'm, I'm looking forward to sharing uh, Lisa's work with Chicago. What I love about uh, Amelia's take on Medea is I love the shifts. Um, where it, it goes from just despair and then suddenly into hilarity and dark comedy and you know from highbrow to utterly lowbrow um, and just honoring both and having a great deal of fun.